We could have been Splash Brothers before the Splash Brothers were ever invented, him and I. We, our, our shooting games were unbelievable. Glenn, you know, is one of the, my favorite teammates of all time. You know, Glenn uh, is a, first of all, great guy, uh, such a talent, you know. You know, he had that knack, you know, and then when I had the opportunity to play with a guy that can stroke like that, I mean, you just look over and just lick the chops because you know that, hey, nine out of 10, if you get to him, it's going in. Here's Rice, squares up, Look fires up. the three. That's Nobody's Glenn a better Rice. shooter, Jack, That's than Rice. Rice. G. Rice, matches, you know what that means. Congratulations on your night. Uh, it's gonna be a fantastic night for you. I've been there and done it. Uh, you're gonna have a lot of fun. Congratulations, man, and I'm really proud of you. G Money, you know I love you. I appreciate your time uh, spending with me and uh, playing together it was a lot of fun. You're the man. All the best. Take care. First, I just want to say congratulations, big fella. Glenn, it was an honor to play with you, alongside of you. Um, this is well deserving. Congratulations, Glenn, on a fantastic career. You talk about one of the best shooters ever in the NBA, you talk about Glenn Rice. Glenn, you gave us a lot of great nights in a Hornets uniform, nights that we didn't have any reason to expect. And of course, you exceeded those expectations and brought the franchise probably three of the most successful seasons that it has ever had, culminating in 54 wins in your last season with the Hornets. Congratulations on an outstanding career and what you've done for the Charlotte Hornets. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us tonight as we recognize a true Hornets legend. At this time, please direct your attention to center court and welcome Charlotte Hornets President and Vice Chairman Fred Whitfield, President of Basketball Operations and General Manager Mitch Kupchak, Executive Vice President and Chief Operating Officer Pete Gwelly, and Executive Vice President and Chief Administrative Officer James Jordan, along with two of Glenn Rice's former teammates, Del Curry and Muggsy Bogues. And now, Buzz City. Get on your feet and greet the man of the hour, the only player to play in three NBA All-Star games and earned multiple NBA team selections during his Hornets career. The franchise's career leader in points per game, three-point percentage and minutes per game. At 6'8", forward from Michigan, number 41, Glenn Rice. Honored to have Glenn Rice here tonight to recognize his contributions to our franchise. One of the greatest scorers to ever wear a Hornets uniform. He's our career leader in points per game and three point percentage. His best season came in 1996 97. Not coincidentally, it was the best season in franchise history with 54 wins. Glenn has franchise single season records in total points, points per game, and three point percentage. He was MVP of an all-star game, second team all NBA, all-star in each of his three full seasons with the Hornets. He's our only player right now to have represented Charlotte in three All-Star games. Hopefully, that'll be changing soon. He was also third-team All-NBA in 1997. He's our only player to make multiple All-NBA teams during his Hornets career. It is my honor and privilege to present Glenn with the key to Buzz City in recognition of his achievements during his time 
with our Hornets. I am also pleased to unveil this cell that will be, will be displayed on the concourse to commemorate his place in our Hornets history. Glenn, on behalf of our entire organization and our fans, thank you for all you have done for our organization and our city. Wow. 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 Um, thank, first of all, I want to say thanks to God for making this day possible. Uh, without him, a lot of, you know, things wouldn't be true. And you guys make me feel so comfortable. I remember the first time I was traded here. It was my first time get, experiencing the business side of the NBA. I was coming here through a trade when you lost your franchise player. What made it extra special for me after that moment when I got off the airplane, when I realized, okay, I'm in Charlotte, a new team. There was fans there that said, Glenn Rice, we appreciate you. Glenn Rice, we're glad to have you. Glenn Rice, we love you. From that very moment, I felt like I was at home, and I felt that it was my duty to go out and not just represent Glenn Rice, but to represent the city of Charlotte, the Charlotte Hornets organization the best way I could. And I hope I did you guys proud. I'd like to thank the Charlotte Hornet organization for doing something I could have never imagined, having a Glenn Rice day. That's something you just don't think you'll get. My appreciation goes beyond words. Thank you very much. As always, you don't get to this position alone. I am glad as hell that I have my former teammates and good friends, Muggsy and Dale Curry, standing with me. They helped me from losing it tonight. I was getting very emotional, and thank God they're here. Thank each and every one of you. You helped make Glenn Rice the person and the player that he is today. Thank you. Buzz City, let's hear it one more time for Glenn Rice.